Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. On this channel I share our journey on this beautiful spot in the world. An island above the Arctic Circle in northern Norway called Anduja. A place where we try to build up a life close to nature. When we took a trip around the island during the last week, again we realized how unique and untouched the nature is here and how thankful we are to be here. My partner is born in this area and I'm from the Netherlands. When we came together and we decided to move to this island, it felt for both of us as a missing puzzle piece fit into the right place. The life what we can build up here is something we were both dreaming of. That I'm living here now is because I followed my inner voice that lead me here. I want to wish everybody a happy new year and I want to welcome all the new followers to my channel. And for this year, I hope to inspire you to follow your inner voice. Because you have only one life and it is your life. We are renovating an old Scandinavian house all by ourselves and our first goal is to make the house livable so that we can move in and continue from there on. We had quiet and cozy holidays with traditional Norwegian food, which I think I will make a separated video from next year. And also some of my tradition and that is eating turkey.
Because we were all affected by COVID, we almost haven't made any progress in our house. We started with organizing the tiles, which will come into our tiny hall. But because it was so cold in the last days, we could not start with it, because we were afraid that the glue won't dry because of the frost. So we decided to continue with preparing the electricity for the electrician. The first day of the new year, I saw the Northern Lights as strongest since I moved to Norway. We passed 21 of December, so that means that from now on it will be a little bit lighter every day. Right now we still have daylight between 10 and 2 o'clock, without to see the sun. I now experience my second winter here, and I like the big contrast between the light summer and dark winter. Andoya is the northeast island of the island group Lufoten and Westeron, which is located above the Arctic Circle. Last week we heard on the news that the temperatures were very low in Scandinavia, and it was cold here too. But because we live close to the ocean, it is milder up here than inland. Last week the temperature dropped until minus 18 degrees Celsius, which is the coldest I experienced until so far but inland it can even go up to minus 40 degrees Celsius.
It doesn't happen so often that you can ice skate here in the winter, because normally the lakes are covered by snow. But now, after some rain and frost, it was possible to skate for the first time here in Norway. It was a beautiful first experience for me and our son Torsten Björn. And for me, coming from the Netherlands, it was strange to have the whole lake for ourselves without to be with anybody else around me. Norway is one of the countries who is drinking the most coffee in the world. It's a social thing here and when you visit somebody you always offered coffee and cake. <laughs> 